Good morning. <laughs> I feel so sick this morning. I don't know why. I just woke up. It's like 9 a.m. right now. Today is going to be a really busy day. I'm going to take you along my productive day in my life and basically getting my life together because it's almost my birthday. It's actually my birthday in five days and I just feel like a little like a mess. Let's get our lives together. I've actually been awake for like 20 minutes, but I haven't really been doing anything. I've just been rolling around in my bed, specifically trying not to go on my phone. I saw a TikTok. Oh my god, my voice. I saw a TikTok yesterday talking about a low dopamine morning. I think that was what it was called. It was saying that like if you start your day off on your phone, then that's like your first hit of dopamine. Then the rest of the day, you're a little dopamine gremlin. And like you can't get work done because you just do little things that give you like instant joy, which is literally me yesterday. Like I will wake up and and then be like, where's my phone? Um, go on my phone for a bit, try to do work, go on my phone for a bit, try to do work, eat something, try to do work, eat something again, go on my phone. Like, it's just, it's just not okay. So basically they said, don't go on your phone, start your day off with getting dopamine from making your bed, doing the dishes, doing a chore, standing in the sun for a little bit to like get your nervous system awake, get the ball rolling before you go on your phone so your brain, it feels like a sense of accomplishment from already having some things done with natural dopamine. So that's what we're trying today. Haven't checked my phone. It just dinged. Let's start off with opening the windows, doing the bed. Let's get today on a good start. After making my bed, I head into the kitchen and fill up my water bottle. This has helped me so much with staying hydrated and just feeling overall so much better throughout the day. I also then took my daily vitamins and then drank some water. I also used my face roller to depuff my face and then I played some music on Spotify. This automatically makes me feel so much better. <laughs> I also always open the doors in my apartment just because I love the fresh air and I feel like I can hear the cars and people and the wind and just really like the sound of that. Today I just stood outside and let some vitamin D hit my face because you know I needed to get the nervous system awake and I think it's called your circadian rhythm started so you know it's daytime and it's time to get working. Next up we got to get our hair out of our faces and we're going to wash our face. This automatically makes me feel so much better and fresh. After this is done I'm just going to put in my contacts. I feel like I can't even get the day started unless I can see properly. I then used some products by Peach and Lily. I used their face mist and their matcha pudding antioxidant cream. Both of these are super refreshing and really good quality. I also applied some deodorant and I brushed my teeth just because, you know, we gotta make sure the hygiene is down. This will just set the tone of your day. And lastly, I went in with a light makeup look. I feel like I look good. I feel so much more productive. I have more energy to do stuff throughout the day and I am planning on filming a few things during this day. So if I have my makeup on in the beginning, it'll motivate me to get into that a lot faster. I then changed out of my pajamas to feel like I'm ready to take on the day and today I'm wearing this Lululemon set which this video is actually sponsored by Lululemon but we're gonna get into that in a minute. This set is so cute and perfect for fall. It is this like burnt brown color and they actually also just released these shoes. It is their first pair of female footwear and the very last thing I did to conclude this little morning routine was get on my computer, answer some texts, some emails and kind of plan out my day so that I'm not going into it blindly. I've done my whole morning routine even though <laughs> like I feel like it's pretty easy to get all of that done. I feel like the past few days I've been in really a slump that doing all of that still felt like an accomplishment and you know what sometimes if getting out of bed and you know washing your face and doing your hair and doing your makeup and putting on fresh clothes and you know not looking on your phone is your biggest accomplishment that is okay sometimes you know that's the best we can do but I'm feeling pretty good right now so I'm you know I'm excited for the rest of the day. I feel like we're off on a good start and something that really helps me set my day off on the right foot is working out. That is why I'm wearing this cute brown Lululemon set. Today we're going to be working out with the new Lululemon Studio Mirror. And this video is actually sponsored by Lululemon, which is honestly a dream to be able to even say because you guys know how much I love fitness and working out and yoga. And I'm so excited to be partnering with Lululemon on this video. So let's go over the Lululemon Studio Mirror. It is a hybrid fitness experience that allows members to experience original classes and programs from Lululemon lemon and the best boutique fitness studios in the industry from boxing to yoga and you're able to stream them 24 7 you may recognize a few but they've got army forward space y7 studio dog pound which i'm so excited for that one rumble yoga six pure bar and akt and they even have like meditation classes and i'm just so happy because you have access to gyms that you wouldn't even be able to have in your country in your freaking room like dog pound i don't think is in canada i think it's only in the u.s and every time i go to the u.s i want to work out there and it has 
hasn't happened yet, so I'm so glad that I have it in the comfort of my own home, right from your Lululemon studio mirror or virtually anywhere. I think this is a super great idea because not only does it mix the idea of having your conventional at-home workout, but it mixes with the community studio aspect of in-person classes. Now that is a big thing for me. You guys probably know this myself because I talk about it all the time about how going to classes really motivates you. There's a whole bunch of other people there doing the same kinds of goals as you. And in this way, you can have that connection because you can connect with other users online that are doing the same workout classes as you and you can have that full experience on the go. These workouts are led by their 15 world-class Lululemon Studio trainers and each of them have their own area of expertise so they know what they're talking about and a lot of them have had previous careers such as like ballerinas, athletes, etc. You're even able to go on like their website and look into each trainer individually so if you really connect with one you can like take all of their classes. So this mirror is the ultimate home gym. They also have a full 40 inch HD 1080p display which shows your trainer alongside your own reflection. They also have a high fidelity speaker system to hear class instructions and music either from their own curated playlists or from your own Apple music. There's also optional Lululemon Studio weights that can connect via Bluetooth to your mirror and count your reps for you on the screen. There's also free delivery with this mirror and installation is just an additional cost. Working out makes all the difference for me in my mental health, my physical health, emotional health, like all the healths above. I just don't think that there is anything better and as we've been talking about throughout this video you know we're trying to get that natural dopamine that serotonin and working out is what does it for me I would absolutely love for you guys to try it with me and connect with me so without further ado let's get on into the actual workout there she is tell me this isn't the coolest invention like I am obsessed with this let's turn on the app because you need to have it at the same time so relaxed I feel like sleeping now I'm like girl it is 11 a.m. we got stuff to do but I'm like so calm now I ended up doing a vinyasa core today which was super fun by Katie it's an intermediate course and it was 30 minutes this is gonna be a new tool of mine to support my well-being all links will be in the description if you guys want to shop the lululemon studio mirror it is paired with the lululemon studio app thank you again lululemon for sponsoring this video I appreciate you guys more than you know it's been a little bit later since I did my workout and right now I have so much work to do i'm honestly really stressed out i'm going to currently make a screen recording for one of my videos that i need to film and then i think we're gonna go to a cafe after and do some editing there because i swear if i stay in my apartment for any longer i'm gonna go insane so i need to screen record my screen and talk at the same time so that i will be able to edit them both together <laughs> just changed into a pair of black Lululemon leggings. These are my favorite. They are like all the way down to your ankles. And I just bought a pair of mini Uggs. These are such a big trend this year and I'm so happy that I got my hands on some of them. I ended up getting the ultra mini regular Uggs. I kind of wish I got the platform ones. It's so annoying because I was debating between these ones or the platform ones. And literally the day after I bought these was the viral picture of Bella Hadid wearing the platform ones and now everybody wants the platform ones. So honestly, whatever. Maybe it was a good thing that I stuck to my gut. Some other pair of Uggs that I really want are the Tasman. They look like this. I think those I might get and then if I do get them, I'll get them in platform so that I have one platform, one without. But yeah, they're super cute and perfect for fall. They just give me like such a good October vibe. The only thing I have against them is that why are they like hard to put on? Like this little ankle slit is not like they're just so hard to put on. I didn't show this on camera, but I did end up having like a mini cereal with two dates, kind of random. But I had that a little bit earlier while I was working. So now I'm like, you know, I want to situate myself in a cafe, maybe get some lunch, maybe get a coffee. I actually really want a coffee. One thing I will say is though, I kind of have gotten into the habit of drinking a lot of caffeine, which I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Definitely isn't. I'm going to be bringing my bag here, a computer, a whole bunch of stuff. Um, I'm just going to get my wallet and then we are ready to rumble. It's such a beautiful day today. My laptop actually broke but I ended up getting a new 
laptop, which is super exciting. I can show it to you guys when we get to the cafe, but I finally got a new laptop, which means I can go back to working at cafes, which is so exciting. Kind of stupid because I just spent so much time and effort and like money building my perfect like office. And even then I'm like FOMOing on going to cafes and stuff. But something about going to cafes just makes me feel so productive because I have no other option than to get work done because everybody's just staring at you. This is the outfit of the day, a sweater by my fam. It's her merch, can't help but support. This is the comfiest sweater I own. I was walking to one of my favorite coffee shops just called Small Victory. Or like I think they close at like three, but it's actually 3.30 now. Okay, this place may or may not be a little bit fancy. I have my work set up here. I think I'm just gonna get like a coffee and like a salad and just eat something fresh while I do my work. salad with goat cheese and salmon. We're done eating. That was probably the best salad I've ever had in my entire life. I definitely need to go back there with my friends to have actual lunch, but there was no outlet beside me and I finished eating, so I just ended up paying and we're gonna do a switch of location. Gonna go to a different coffee shop and get some more work done there. I'm also obsessed, like look at all the leaves changing in color. Maybe a little candle lighting just so that we get into the fall spirit because I definitely feel like I'm not there yet. home I'm eating a hauls right now because my throat is acting up but as much as I still have to edit we're gonna take a break from that put some music on and just clean my apartment because if I want to make cookies I want to be chilling in a nice environment and it's so messy right now I've been obsessed with Nessa Barrett's music it's it's so good the album actually comes out on my birthday so I'm really looking forward to that apartment and I feel like a new person Whew. there's still definitely a lot of clothes in my closet that I haven't like folded or done the laundry but like for the most part this looks pretty clean I also set up my new flowers they're so beautiful they look very like October -y. I don't know I really like them but yeah the apartment's looking really good and I've set out all my ingredients to start baking also check out my vase tell me this isn't the coolest thing ever I actually thrifted it from Valley Village I've got my computer and I'm just looking at the recipe here I think I have all the ingredients and I think I'm gonna make a reel just because if I'm already cooking I might as well get some more content out of it I'm gonna probably put an oversized shirt on though because I think this is a little bit too tight and then
it is time to try the cookies. They're on these plates right now. I am going to transfer them over onto something cuter in a minute. But let's try them. Oh my god. I don't even know which one to grab. What do I do? Okay, I'm going to grab this one. Yum! Look at how good these look. First impression bite. I'm gonna give it like a solid 8 or 9 out of 10 maybe 9 out of 10 just because I just had a bite of definitely the kosher salt like you are supposed to use a stand mixer and I was using my hand so I do think I had a little bit of a disadvantage but regardless these are really good they just taste kind of like icing sugar and pumpkin very fall like nutmeg cinnamon mm. Mm, 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 mm. I'm also hyped because I just finished editing my video I am gonna transfer them onto this this is actually from Ikea and it's super cute because you can put like cupcakes or cakes or whatever you want on top of it I wanted to show you guys a meditation that is available on the Lululemon Studio Mirror. I actually did this one of the following days, but I decided to add it in this video just because this is what I would be doing in my ideal night. It's just another cool feature about the mirror that I didn't get to explain to you guys earlier, but this is a five minute meditation. It's super easy for all levels, and I really enjoyed doing that. Time to get ready for bed. I'm so tired. It's currently 2 a.m. Why am I still awake? I just wanted to say today was a really good day for me. I feel like honestly yesterday I didn't really have a very good day. I think I was just letting overwhelmness take over my day. And honestly, I feel like doing all the things today, like genuinely just getting out of the house, getting dressed, working out, all of it really helped the way that I felt overall. And I highly encourage you guys that if you're feeling a little bit in a slump, do something like baking or standing outside, walking outside, going to a little cafe taking yourself out for lunch just do something nice for yourself because you won't regret it and it will definitely make you feel recharged it is a little bit late right now i do wish that i went to bed earlier but i did get a lot of work done so i am proud of myself tomorrow i have another busy day ahead of me but i feel like because my apartment is clean now i do feel on like a much better step than i did the past few days i had prior to filming this video i'm going to be filming more vlogs this week if you guys have anything specific that you want to see me do in a vlog or that you want me to show or film please comment them down below because i take inspiration from all of your comments i hope you guys are having a blessed day morning or night whenever you're watching this subscribe if you haven't already thank you again to lululemon for sponsoring this video and good night guys i'm so tired Mwah.